I, I'm in a little bit of different position um, uh, because yes, I, I have books out on the labyrinth, but for me, the real birth into the world was the labyrinth. And that people really come to that when they're ready, unconsciously ready, and, and when they're, they're hungry for something uh, to deepen in their lives. And it's also a time when people come when they're really broken and they need compassion, they need love, they need to be able to, to regroup. And uh, I mean, it, it's, it's, it's a different process, but it isn't. I mean, because, but by walking a labyrinth, y you gather an inner spaciousness inside. Mm -hmm. And there's a place where you can go. And I think it's very important that we, we do have a well-stocked inner world to draw on. That comes back to that relationship. <laughs> but, uh, and that's what people are doing. It's like coming to a watering hole and you, you drink in and, and drink in life and, and gentleness. And, I, and for me, I think the word that I uh, describe in that process is that people find an inner spaciousness. And that takes away the personal judgments mm -hmm. and attacks and, and it allows a process because you cannot force or manipulate yourself in any way. And, and I think people learn that, but that's also a very loving process to learn.